Musk is such a bloody liar, such a con man. It's unbelievable that people can't see it. Uh, they don't want to see it. That's probably why they don't see it. Um, because they want a hero. And I do understand that. But maybe if you found a mirror, you'd see where the hero really is. The top person in this, in this kind of takeover has been Musk because he's been the one that's been hailed as the god. And he's come out this week and talked about a story related to Apple. And Apple are supposedly yeah. getting in bed with open AI and integrating chat GBT and, and open AI products into their devices. And he said if they, he d if they do that, then he's going to ban Apple from... Um, any of his companies, but he's actually got um, a uh, history with OpenAI, hasn't he himself? Yeah. Um, what's happening? This is a, a, a very much goes on to what we've just been talking about. It's about perception, and you have to kid people into perceiving things that actually aren't real and aren't true and aren't really happening. So what you've got now is. Musk, who's criticizing um, OpenAI and criticizing Apple for using OpenAI AI, and, and he's, he's uh, attacking um, Google and all these others. Um, and, and, and all to do with AI. So he's got his own AI. He's got this thing called Grok on X or whatever, and he's got a, uh, a company called... Um, uh, XAI, surprisingly. Um, and, and so what you uh, ask yourself is, okay, there seems to be this competition. There seems to be this rivalry. He's criticizing him. He's criticizing her. Uh, and then you ask, know the outcome and you'll see the journey. What is the outcome of this rivalry and um multi-level criticism of each other. It's that AI is rolled out right across human society. It doesn't matter if it's Google's AI or Apple's AI or Open AI's AI or Musk's AI. AI ends up being rolled out, and that's the point. And this uh, rivalry... Uh, is all part of um, hiding the fact that it's all coordinated. And he um, is now having a go at OpenAI, uh, not least because he and Sam Altman, who's still with OpenAI, um, were co-founders of it. And Musk claims that it should have been an open source um, company, an open source AI. Okay, um, And to the point where... He took out a lawsuit against OpenAI and Altman for um, making money from something that they um, had created as an open source, right? Well, that um, lawsuit was dropped this week by Musk, not least after OpenAI and Altman released emails from Trump, uh, from um, Musk, saying, um, we got to make money, right? I mean, yeah. if you look at the background to um, Elon Musk, and my God, I have and continue to do, he is such a blatant, bloody liar and con man. It's extraordinary the levels um, to which it has gone. And here's another example um, where – you 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 say I'm not going to allow Apple products in in my businesses um, after they've done this deal with um, OpenAI. Um, it's a game. It's a, a vaudeville show. And um, if you if if you if you just focus and 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 remove your preconceived ideas, it's on public display. Yeah, and it's it's ties into the the subjects we've been covering through the show really about this uh, wanting a hero and, you know, looking at information which supports that premise and ignoring information that goes against that premise because it's information you don't want to hear. I feel, you know, the way you've described a religion, Elon Musk has become a religion in a sense to people Absolutely. where it's immovable. Absolutely. It's immovable to support. Uh, on this, um, on this, this Twitter feed thing you get, this news feed or whatever, 
Um, you know, mine is absolutely bombarded, not just with Musk's post. I mean, he's, you know, scattergun posts all day and night. Obviously, not all of them from him, say the least. And, um, and all these other pages of, they are, they are worship. Uh, yeah. They're worshiping him, constantly quoting him and saying what a wonderful man he is and all that stuff. I mean, it is it is a, another religion, just like Trump's a, a, a religion in his own way. In fact, Trump and Musk are basically disciples or or, or 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 gods of the same religion. The disciples are those that believe in them, and um, yeah, this this the whole thing we talked about earlier about religious belief systems, unquestioning, uh, rigid belief systems that um, repel all borders. That's the foundation of human control. Always has been. No wonder they continue with it um, to this day. Yeah, absolutely. I saw an apparent quote from him this morning that said, no woman has ever chosen a six pack over six cars, go to work, not the gym. And it was like, <laughs> right, okay. It's probably not one okay, of Okay, his- well, that's profound. Okay. <laughs> that, that could have come from Jordan Peterson. <laughs> Well, yeah, it could have, absolutely. Well, that's preferred. Well, 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 yeah, well, actually, if you break it down, it's not, mate. Yeah, it's a word salad. 